One of the most, you know, amazing events of my life was going out to see the totality of the 2017 solar eclipse. Can you give us an idea of some of the things that, some of the events that might be coming up in the sky? And you bet. So coming up on April 16th and 17th is uh, basically a conjunction between Mars and the Moon. This is a close encounter of these two worlds in our skies. Now, they're, physically, they're not going to be close. The Moon and Mars are separated by, you know, millions of miles. But to, from our line of sight here on Earth, it's a, it's a great coincidental lineup of where the two worlds look close. So the moon will look like a crescent after sunset uh, and will be visible uh, in your local uh, sunset skies. And then up right next to the moon will be an orange colored star that will appear as darkness falls. And it won't be anything other star-like object in that part of the sky, so you can't miss it. That's planet Mars. And so it's neat to be able to see the two close together. Uh, they'll be really beautiful. You can see the distinct coloration of Mars. That orange color will come through even with the naked eye. That, of course, is all the iron oxide that covers the blankets uh, Mars, right? The dust and sands of Mars are iron oxide rich. And that's the same thing of, right, that rust of, on iron here on Earth. The same chemistry is happening there. And that color is visible, that distinct orange color you can see. So that's really cool. And by the way, just a little plug for uh, Astronomers Without Borders that I also- Plug them about. away. <laughs> international nonprofit. They just do good around the world. I love yeah. helping them out. And they They're have a great campaign. Group. Uh, they have a campaign now called Beauty Without Borders. It's running during Global Astronomy Month. So check them out. They have lots of events for free for, pre for folks around the world. But they're running something called Beauty Without Borders. It's a campaign they do every little, once in a while. And it's related to getting people to take photographs of celestial events. And so they want you to take a photograph of Moon and Mars with your smartphone. They'll teach you how to do it. There's a little explainer on how to do your settings on your smartphone so you can uh, capture both the moon and Mars and then send it into them. There's a little submission form on their site and you can, uh, they will create a video animation of all the submissions from around the world wow. of this moon Mars conjunction. Everybody's, you know, we're all on the globe, right? We're right, all on right. the circular ball. And so we see it from a different orientation. So it'll be really cool to see it all posted together and sort of stack together to, to, to get a sense of, uh, you know, we all share the same sky. Right. You know? so it's a really great campaign. You can find them at astronomerswithoutborders.org. That's awesome. That is just plain awesome. That is a fantastic group.